and welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to another painting video. Today's oil painting is going to be of some random water and rocks. The reference photo I am using is a snapshot from a video I recently took. I loved the idea of painting something random yet interesting from my camera roll. A single frame in a video that had little meaning but I would end up spending hours on it to paint. I also thought that this little scenery of water and rocks would be perfect for practicing to paint oils with. There's so many colours and tones and textures, you have the boldness and sharpness of the rocks and the smooth wavy texture of the water. If you're a beginner oil painter and are interested in learning how I created this painting from start to finish, including the materials and techniques that I used. I have the tutorial and real-time video alongside a recording of my palette over on my Patreon channel. There's more information about that in this video description and at the end of this video. Coming up when adding in the details, you may notice me using a particular brush for most of these details, and I just have to sing its praises as it's made the whole experience a lot easier for me and did exactly what I wanted it to do. It's the Akoya brush from Jackson's Art, in size 0. The shape of the bristles and length was just perfect and I highly recommend it. It's taken a little while for me to find the perfect brush for this kind of painting so I hope this helps you too if you're looking for the perfect brush. For the other parts such as blocking in the colour, I used flat brushes as they're excellent at putting the paint where you want them to go, especially with large areas. Using a large round brush would make things harder in my opinion but I'll link all the materials used below.
Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you have benefited from it in some way. This video is part of a tutorial and real time video I now have live on my Patreon. There you will find my reference photo attached if you would like to have a go at painting this too, along with a talk about the brushes, materials and techniques I use. I believe that painting random yet challenging sceneries such as this is really beneficial to beginner painters. It's a great way to test how you apply colour and texture to your painting. If you choose to sign up to my Patreon, you will also find a ton of real time videos for other things, including cats and dog portraits, realistic human portraits and other scenery paintings. I'm uploading videos there all the time so please check it out if you're looking to improve your art skill. All skill levels are welcome. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.